a bane for the environment but turned into a boon by an incredible innovator from Madurai. Professor Rajagopalan Vasudevan of Thyagrajar College of Engineering has developed a path-breaking method of building roads with plastic waste. It's definitely a great service to the nation and to the world, uh, if I say so, because uh, plastic is the most important material and the poor man's friend, especially in India, if you look into it, Every cottage or hut you can see, you can have only plastic materials. So they can't, you can't prevent them from using it. Therefore, it is going to be in part and part of the life. Therefore, we, we need to find, you can't simply say ban it. We have to find an appropriate utilization. Uh, the road is definitely has become a very good substitute because it consumes large amount of the material. At the same time, it is technology also very simple. So it can be taken to any part and in situ process only, no machinery is involved. Just amount, just you can very easily it adopt any way and solve the very big problem of plastic waste. Encouraged by the former president of India, Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam, it was in 2001 that Professor Vasudevan would break new ground with this eco friendly innovation. An extremely simple process that involves the shredding of multiple layer plastic waste like wrappers, food packets and bottles. Stones needed to lay down the road are then heated up to 175 degrees Celsius. The shredded plastic waste is then sprayed over the heated stones to give it a uniform coating. And finally, bitumen is added. and the mix is ready to be laid on the roads. Almost uh, all the states they have started using now. Actually, first it was utilized at Tamil Nadu. The plastic manufacturers, they joined me and they want to project this idea because plastic, at one stage plastic was to be banned. So in order to show the people plastic can be used, we started laying at Tamil Nadu. So we first started about 100,000 kilometers of roads were laid here. Subsequently, Kerala, Goa, Andhra, Bombay. Now, now the, almost all states in India, in India, they have started laying it. According to Central Pollution Handle Board, India produces 15,000 tons of plastic waste daily. Having laid over 20,000 kilometers of plastic paved roads all across the country, Professor Vasudevan's outstanding innovation provided a perfect solution for this menace. 10 lakh plastic bags are used for a kilometer off road. Not only does plastic prove to be a cheaper alternative than asphalt, but is a better binder and eliminates the problems of potholes. The stone is laminated laminated with, the, with uh, plastic and the plastic acts a beautiful binder between the stone and the vitamin. Water never penetrates and uh, you don't get, you don't form any pothole. And if you use it there, the plastic is not going to harm. The process is very simple, eco-friendly. There is no toxic gas comes out. There is no industry is involved here. Wherever the plastics are available, you can collect, shed it, keep play, and then you can lay the road there itself. You need not go for any industry. Whenever we walk on the road, we see tons of plastic waste on the both sides of the road. It's really great that someone uh, has made this into a road. Instead of throwing it away and causing more pollution, we can use it for uh, roads so that it, it can be more durable. However, Professor Vasudevan's breakthrough could not have been possible without the unconditional support from his institute. It was here that this crusader laid the foundation of his innovation. Despite the patent being in the college's name, they also allow the state governments to use their technology free of cost. Not only is the college proud of their chemistry professor, but also provides a helping hand to further this unique cause. The college is very proud of uh, whatever uh, Dr. Vasudevan has done in this particular area. This was the first patent which was obtained in the uh, campus. And this was uh, primarily on uh, the uh, socially relevant area. It's a very good innovation, I think. Uh, 
in india most of the countries and cities have yes, excess of plastics it's a nice innovation he has done a great a great job i think uh, we have to thank him the, uh, the people have to thank him because uh, instead of uh, throwing the plastics outside he has done he has made uh, op opportunity has made a uh, solution to reuse the plastics at 70 this passionate innovator is unstoppable he hopes his hunger to serve the country not only transforms the lives of many but is an inspiration for the youth as well definitely the, the current generation should be motivated more about that because we have we have a lot of potential here and innovation now should go more in the appropriate technology